Hi everybody, I'm Doug. I'm Crystal. And this is the recap for week two of Balboa Fundamentals. This is May 2015. Yeah, that's about it. <laughs> All right. Uh, so last week we covered the two different kinds of basics and a come around. So really quick review. That was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This is the uphold basic. And then we also did the downhold basic. And then we did a come around, which is just sort of a rotation of the basic. And we use mixed footwork for this. So this week, we did a toss out. And so a toss out comes in between a come around and ends with the back end of a come around. So we sort of split the come around between and put the toss out inside it. So we talked about a couple of things with this. We talked about this stretch on mm -hmm. seven. How? So follows for this stretch, we're gonna make sure that we continue to twist into the stretch with our hips. So at the top of our body stops, but our hips keep going as far as our bodies will naturally allow. Leaders, uh, we're letting this stretch happen and waiting for the follow to stretch into our arm. We're not trying to push on her to create it, and we're not um, going to try and jump away to create it on our own. Um, I kick at the end of that seven, but the kick is not that important. I can do this stretch without that kick. A couple of other notes we had. Uh, this is a connected move. It's that first half of the come around. So we need to stay connected up until five of that move. So if I count it through one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it's between like five and six that we're separating and stretching apart. Mm -hmm. And do we have other notes? I think those are the two major ones. Yeah, um, so we, uh, we talked about on the four, which happens right here, we're sort of pressing in a little bit and then releasing the follow into this right arm. So we're not pushing her out. We're letting the compression and right. the opening up of the right arm sort of roll her out. We also talked about um, the relative position of our connected arms. They should be at a relaxed state, so not too high up or too high out, but just in the normal, uh, comfortable, relaxed state. And I talked to the followers about making sure that your fingers go over your lead's hand, um, that you have a bend at the knuckles. Yep. So, one last time. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You guys all had awesome uh, toss outs at the end of the session, so it was really good to see you work through that really complicated move. So right. we're looking forward to seeing you next time for some cool stuff. And uh, Keep see dancing. you in Balboa Land. Bye.